हेलो स्टूडेंट्स साई राम टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू कंटिन्यू अवर प्रीवियस चैप्टर दैट इज इनपुट आउटपुट डिवाइसेस बिफोर वी स्टार्ट जस्ट हैव एन ओवरलुक ऑफ प्रीवियस चैप्टर वी लर्न व्हाट इज कंप्यूटर सिस्टम इनपुट प्रोसेस आउटपुट एंड hardware and software okay now we are going to start input devices what is input device the devices through which we enter data and instruction are called input devices okay our first input device is keyboard now what is keyboard a computer keyboard is an input device used to enter characters and function into the computer system by pressing buttons or keys it is primary device used to enter text a keyboard typically contain keys for individual letters numbers and special characters a commonly used keyboard has 104 keys which can be divided into many groups based on their function this is called keyboard now we will learn how many types of keys in a keyboard there are five types of keys on a keyboard typing keys control keys navigation keys function keys and numeric key pad now what is typing keys these keys includes letters that is alphabet keys 26 alphabet keys are present on a keyboard from a to z these keys are not present in a alphabetical order these keys are used to type word sentence or paragraph number keys are used for typing numbers these keys are present above the top row of the alphabet keys these keys include punctuation that is comma semicolon and special symbols like plus minus keys these keys also include the shift caps lock space bar backspace and the tap keys this is called typing keys second key is control keys in computing a control key is a modifier key which when pre when pressed in a combination with another key perform a special operation for example control plus c similarly to the shift key the control key rarely perform any function when pressed by itself the control key is located on or near the bottom of bottom side of the keyboard CTRL Alt Windows logo keys and the escape key are the various example of control keys third one is function keys function keys is one of the f keys along the top of a computer keyboard these keys are labeled as f1 to f12 function keys may be used as single keys command example f5 or maybe combined with one or more modifier keys example alt plus f4 in either case function keys typically serve as a keyboard shortcut to perform a specific functions this is called a function keys the fourth one is navigation keys every keyboard has some special navigation 
keys such as cursor control keys that is arrow keys home end page up page down insert keys these navigation keys are used for moving through the document or a web page pages and ending the text this is called a navigation the fifth one is numeric key pad the numeric key pad arrange the numerals 0 through 9 the arithmetic operations like addition subtraction multiplication and division the decimal point as they would appear on the calculator or adding machines it is placed on the right side of the keyboard and is used for entering numbers at a fast speed this is called five types of keys now second input device is mouse mouse is a pointing input device with two or three button on its top mouse helps to control cursor that is visible on the computer screen while moving the mouse on flat surface place mouse reduce usability of a keyboard it is used to point select and open file or folder on the screen it is also used to draw a picture this is called a now third input device is scanner a scanner is an input device that scan documents such as photographs and pages of text the scanner create an electronic version of the document that can be viewed and edit on a computer most scanner are flat bed devices which means they can a flat scanning surface this is called scanner there are three types of scanner flat bed scanner sheet field scanner and hand held scanner what is flat bed scanner a flat bed scanner is an optical scanner which makes us as uh, of a flat scanner uh, flat surface for scanning document what is sheet field scanner a sheet field scanner is a digital digital ima imaging system specially designed for scanning loose sheets of paper and what is handheld scanner a handheld scanner is a bar shaped electronic device that uh, that dig digitally capture and store images portable and running on batteries this is called three types of scanner now the fourth input device is barcode reader barcode are simply a set of symbols used to represent alphanumeric information instead of seeing a number 1 or a letter a you would see a series of black and white bar in a various combination and in a different width a barcode reader consist of a light source a lens and a light sensor it reads the barcodes and send the information to the computer this is called barcode reader now fifth input device is light pen a light pen is a computer input device in the form of a light sensitive wand used in a conjunction with the computer's crt monitors it allows the user to point to display object or draw on the screen it is mainly used by engineers fashion designer and architectures this is called light pen the sixth input device is digital camera a digital camera is used to take a photos photograph and record voice photos or videos taken by the digital camera are stored in a memory chip 
inside the camera then the digital camera is plugged into the computer and the images or a video are transferred to the computer for storing editing and printing this is called in, uh, this is called digital camera the seventh input device is web camera what is web camera a webcam is a video input device used to digitize images or a video from the outside world into the computer it capture the video in a live this is called web camera the next input device is microphone a microphone is an input device which is used to record voice music and sound into the computer system this is called microphone now what is touchpad touchpad is used on laptop computers it is similar to mouse it is a touch sensitive pad you can control the movement of the pointer on the screen by moving the finger on the touch pad this is called touch pad the last input device is touch screen a touch screen is a computer display screen that is sensitive to human human touch we can select object object directly by touching the touching with fingers without using any pointing devices for example atm machines and cell phones etc this is called input devices so student here we learn different kinds of input devices i hope student this is clear to all of you here we are going to stop the chapter we will continue the chapter from the next class thank you and sai ram